Hey bunnies. Welcome to another video. For today's video, we are going to be talking about another topic that has come up on social media. I know my nails need to be done. I'm about to do them right now as soon as I'm done filming this, okay? Okay, so don't judge me. Now, excuse me. <laughs> Now, this one has been floating around for a couple of days now, and the girl who posted it, she came with a video like, oh, honey, it's not what it is. All right. So this post, the girl posted a screenshot of a text message that her friend sent her, right? And what attached was the outfit that she was wearing. Now, the outfit she was wearing was this one piece bodysuit type thing with the mesh cutouts and the text read i feel like you're you were trying to show me up at my birthday and that was not cool so she shared the screenshot she shared a picture of her of herself and social media started posting according to her video that she posted today or yesterday social media just found some random girl in like who was also at the location and put her picture next to it right so the the girl she's wearing like an orange dress i think it's a one strap situation going on she looked really cute but really simple um i commented on a post and i was like um insecurity is a hell of a thing and got a lot of traction with that um so yeah that's what we're going to be discussing today now if the girl is telling the truth that the girl in orange isn't the friend, that's not the person who sent the this text message, I feel like my stance still stands. Like insecurity is a hell of a thing. If it's my birthday, I want all my friends to dress up and look their absolute best. Okay, like they should look like tens across the board. I also am going to make sure that I look my absolute best. If it just so happens that my friend is prettier than me or dresses better than I do or has better style than I have, good for her. I am confident within myself and my style and my gorgeous face to know that I look good. Okay, it's my birthday. You can't make me cry on my birthday. You're not my man. <laughs> <laughs> now another key point to note is that the girl who was in the the friend who was in a black outfit she had flowers the flowers were not for the birthday girl the flowers were for her now in the video that she posted today she said that she received the flowers before she went to the birthday party and she didn't even bring the flowers to the birthday party so the flowers should be and it's a good thing I watched this video before making this, that video before making this video, because if without that context, without that extra backstory, I would have been like, okay, the flowers are OD. You're definitely trying to show up your friend. But now for the friend to text her and say, I feel like you were trying to outdo me on my birthday. That's serious, serious insecurities at like a million percent. Okay, if you feel like your friend was trying to outdress you or outdo you on your birthday, then maybe you need to either reevaluate your friendships, right? Or you need to create more of a loving experience, a loving mindset, a loving, you know, ad ad adapt, try to gain a little bit more confidence within yourself. Okay, either step your style up or something. If you don't like the way your friend dresses, then that's a whole other thing. But if you feel like she was trying to outdo you, that means you do kind of like her dress and you wish you could dress like her. Okay. Another thing I did not like about that whole situation is the friend posting the text on social media because that was kind of attention seeky and it it kind of proved the friend's point that she was trying to show her up. And then even if she wasn't trying to show her up, that's not a friend move to make. Why would you screenshot that if you two are actually friends? Why would you share that to social media if you two are actually friends? There are, you never know what's going to go viral. You really never know what's going to go viral unless you're like a Drewski or something. And I feel like every comedian, every 
um, content creator, they have their time. They have their moments where they're hot. And then by next week, they're just forgotten, right? So we have to be more mindful of the things that we put out here on the internet. I have to make sure that I'm more mindful of the things that I put out here on the internet. Um, because sometimes I'll just film like right now, these past couple videos, I'm, I just, I'm just lazy to get up and set up lights and whatever. So I'm sitting on the bed with my tiny, um, my Sony camera and my little tripod and my little ring light because I, I'm just lazy. Oh, okay. <laughs> so we have to be more mindful of the things that we're putting out, the content that we're putting out for people to absorb and to form their opinions on. So in this situation, was the friend right to text that to her other friend? I personally would never have done that. I want, I would hope if I have a birthday dinner or a birthday party, all my friends show up dressed to the nines and look amazing. So then we take pictures. We all just look like baddies all together. So I personally would never text that to a friend. If I was with her, I would have said, do not send that text message. Excuse me. <laughs> Why am I so burpy today? Excuse me. Um, as far as the girl who received the text was wearing the black outfit. One, I would not wear that to a birthday dinner. If we're going to the club, sure. Like there's a time and a place for everything. That outfit was not dinner appropriate right and even i made a tweet the other day and i was like streetwear club wear is what am i saying club wear is a new streetwear and stripper wear is a new club wear and it is so true the things that you would see strippers wear usually little see-through lingerie mesh looking titties all out ass all out yes this has always been a thing where women would dress more provocatively to go to the club but no they are literally wearing stripper outfits to the club right and the things that we would wear to the club back in my day <laughs> the dresses and stuff were wearing as streetwear so the outfit that she had on for dinner, it was a cute little fit, but that that's, was more club appropriate. Unless they had plans to go to a club afterwards, which I don't see why you couldn't change after dinner. But that's a whole other conversation. I guess I'm too grown. I don't know. Because if I get invited to a birthday dinner, which I did and I am going tomorrow, um, I'm not wearing a half-naked club spandex suit no we're gonna go to dinner at an appropriate time in the evening <laughs> we're going to eat we're going to wine we're going to dine right we're going to laugh we're going to have fun if we decide to go to a party afterwards babes i'm going home and i'm changing okay unless it's something more casual where we're wearing you know something more casual then that's different but if we're dressed up to the nines i'm not wearing that to the club because time and a place for everything i, mean, I don't know i don't know i'm i'm just a middle-aged woman i don't <laughs> these young people you young folks you you guys you know you know better than me but as far as i'm concerned like the outfit was a little bit much and if the birthday girl is a simpler girl and that's her style, fine. But don't take out your insecurities on your friends, okay? And back to the girl who wore the black um, spandex outfit. You should not have posted that screenshot on, 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 on the internet. You should not, you should not, you should not. As a friend receiving that, you two are not friends. <laughs> you two are not friends like that y'all probably if anything here here's my thought process you two probably knew each other for a very very long time right and at this point y'all just just stayed friends right so oily i felt like i had a booger in my nose just now you two have been friends for a very long time you just stayed friends i'm gonna invite her i'm gonna invite trisha to my birthday dinner all right bomb trisha come to the birthday dinner um, or a situation where you guys are new friends or your frenemies or you want to take somebody man or something like that. 
but you two are not like girlfriends. You two cannot be girlfriends because if I text my girlfriend something and she screenshots it trying to ridicule me because that's all she was trying to do, ridicule the girl. Yeah. But the girl who sent the text message, super insecure. The girl who posted the text message, super narcissistic. Horrible friendship. Horrible, horrible friendship. <laughs> Sound off in the comment section below and let me know what you guys think of the situation. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, peace sign and kissy face. I'm gonna go do my nails. They look horrible. Like I said, I have a dinner sickle so tomorrow, so bye. <laughs>